A light sport aircraft LSA, or light sport aircraft, is a fairly new category of small, lightweight aircraft that are simple to fly. LSAs tend to be heavier and more sophisticated than ultralight aka microlight aircraft, but LSA restrictions on weight and performance separates the category from established GA aircraft. There is no standard worldwide description of an LSA. Topic: <laughs> LSAs in different countries. National aviation authorities in different countries have their own particular specifications and regulations which define the LSA category. For example, in Australia the Civil Aviation Safety Authority defines a light sport aircraft as a heavier than air or lighter than aircraft, other than a helicopter, with a maximum gross takeoff weight of not more than 560 kg 1,235 pounds for lighter than aircraft, 600 kg 1,323 pounds for heavier than aircraft not intended for operation on water or 650 kilograms 1433 pounds for aircraft intended for operation on water it must have a maximum stall speed of 45 knots 83 kilometers per hour 52 miles per hour in landing configuration a maximum of 2 seats there is no limit on maximum speed unless it is a glider which is limited to VNE 135 KNCAS fixed undercarriage except for amphibious aircraft which may have repositionable gear and gliders which may have retractable gear and unpressurized cabin, and a single non-turbine engine driving a propeller if it is a powered aircraft. In the United States, several distinct groups of aircraft may be flown as light sport. Existing certificated aircraft and experimental, amateur-built aircraft that fall within the definition listed in 14 CFR 1.1 are acceptable, as are aircraft built to an industry consensus standard rather than FAA airworthiness requirements. The accepted consensus standard is defined by ASTM International Technical Committee F-37. Aircraft built to the consensus standard may be factory built and sold with a special airworthiness certification SLSA or may be assembled from a kit under the experimental rules ELSA under experimental airworthiness. A company must have produced and certified at least one SLSA in order to be permitted to sell ELSA kits of the same model. ELSA kits are not subject to the normal experimental amateur built EAB requirement 14 CFR 21.191 which identifies an aircraft the major portion of which has been fabricated and assembled by persons who undertook the construction project solely for their own education or recreation topic United States FAA light sport aircraft The FAA defines a light sport aircraft as an aircraft, other than a helicopter or powered lift, that since its original certification, has continued to meet the following Max Gross takeoff weight, 1,320 pounds 600 kilograms or 1,430 pounds for seaplanes 650 kilograms Max. Stall speed, 45 knots 83 kilometers per hour, 52 miles per hour CAS Max. Speed in level flight at sea level in the U.S. standard atmosphere, 120 knots, 220 kilometers per hour, 140 miles per hour, CAS Max. Seats, 2 Max. Engines, motors, 1 if powered. 
propeller, fixed pitch or ground adjustable, cabin, unpressurized, fixed pitch, semi rigid, teetering, two blade rotor system, if a gyroplane. Landing gear, fixed except for seaplanes and gliders aircraft licensing. Can be manufactured and sold ready to fly under a new special light sport aircraft certification category. Aircraft must meet industry consensus standards. Aircraft under this certification may be used for sport and recreation, flight training, and aircraft rental can be licensed experimental light sport aircraft ELSA if kit or plans built aircraft under this certification may be used only for sport and recreation and flight instruction for the owner of the aircraft can be licensed experimental light sport aircraft ELSA if the aircraft has previously been operated as an ultralight but does not meet the FAR Part 103 definition of an ultralight vehicle. These aircraft must have been transitioned to ELSA category no later than January 31, 2008. Will have a standard FAA registration, N number. Category and class includes, airplane, land, sea, gyroplane, airship, balloon, weight shift control, trike, land, sea, glider, and powered parachute. U.S. or foreign manufacture of light sport aircraft is authorized. Aircraft with a standard airworthiness certificate that meet above specifications may be flown by sport pilots. However, the aircraft must remain in standard category and cannot be changed to light sport aircraft category. May be operated at night if the aircraft is equipped per FAR 91.205, if such operations are allowed by the aircraft's operating limitations and the pilot holds at least a private pilot certificate and a minimum of a third class medical, FAA certification. Several different kinds of aircraft may be certificated as LSA. Airplanes, both powered and gliders, rotorcraft, gyroplanes only, not helicopters, powered parachutes, weight shift control aeroplanes, commonly known as trikes, and lighter than aircraft, free balloons and airships may all be certificated as LSA if they fall within the weight and other guidelines established by the local governing authority. The U.S. definition of an LSA is similar to some other countries' definition of microlight or ultralight aircraft. Except for the LSA's relatively generous MTOW of 1,320 pounds, the other countries' microlight definitions are typically less restrictive, not limiting airspeed or the use of variable pitch propellers. By contrast, the US FAA has a separate definition of ultralight aircraft defined in Federal Aviation Regulations. Aircraft falling within the US ultralight specifications are extremely lightweight, less than 254 pounds if powered or 155 pounds if unpowered, are intended for manned operation by a single occupant, have a fuel capacity of 5 US gallons, about 19 liters or less, a maximum calibrated airspeed of not more than 55 knots, 102 kilometers per hour, 63 miles per hour, and a maximum stall speed of not more than 24 knots 44 kilometers per hour, 28 miles per hour. Ultralight aircraft in the U.S. do not require pilot licensing, medical certification, or aircraft registration. Aircraft certified as light sport aircraft exceed the limitations defined for ultralight aircraft and require that the pilot possess, at a minimum, a sport pilot certificate. Among these aircraft were found those that were specifically designed to meet the LSA requirements, as well as overweight ultralights commonly known as fat ultralights. 
that previously were operated in technical violation of 14 CFR 103. In addition to aircraft specifically designed to meet the LSA requirements, certain certificated aircraft, such as the original Piper Cub, happen to fall within the definition of a light sport aircraft and can be operated by individuals holding FAA sport pilot certificates. The aircraft cannot be recertificated as LSA. However, although sport pilots may operate conventionally certificated aircraft that fall within the definition of an LSA, the aircraft themselves continue to be certificated in their original categories. Several designers and manufacturers of experimental aircraft kits have developed models that are compliant with the light sport aircraft rules. In June 2012 the FAA indicated that they would re-visit the LSA program after their own studies indicated that the majority of LSA manufacturers they had inspected failed to show that they were in compliance with the standards. The FAA announcement said that as a result the original policy of reliance on manufacturer statements of compliance should be reconsidered. AOPA points out that this is a normal development of a maturing standard and does not expect any significant changes in the rules, only more scrutiny by FAA to assure compliance. FAA certified models Aircraft that met light sport requirements when the rules were announced appear in FAA's list, light sport aircraft, existing type certificated models. Some additional models of SLSA, ELSA and EAB aircraft that meet light sport requirements are listed here. Europe. In June 2011, the European Aviation Safety Agency published CSLSA certification specifications for light sport aeroplanes. This introduced a new category of manufactured sport aeroplanes similar to the light sport category found in the USA and elsewhere. Topic: Australia A new certification category for light sport aircraft came into effect on the 7th of January 2006. This category does not replace the previous categories, but created a new category with the following characteristics. A maximum takeoff weight of 600 kilograms, 1323 pounds or 650 kilograms, 1433 pounds for an aircraft intended and configured for operation on water or 560 kilograms, 1235 pounds for a lighter than air aircraft. A maximum stalling speed in the landing configuration VSO of 45 kn 83 km per hour CAS. Maximum of two occupants, including the pilot. A fixed landing gear. A glider may have retractable landing gear. For an aircraft intended for operation on water, a fixed or repositionable landing gear. A single, non-turbine engine fitted with a propeller. A non-pressurized cabin. If the aircraft is a glider a maximum never exceed speed VNE of 135 kn 250 km per hour, Caslight Sport aircraft can be factory manufactured aircraft or kits for amateur building. Topic. See also Canadian Advanced Ultralight Aircraft List of Ultralight Helicopters